Hi guys, it's Reborn Special 32 here and Mia is with me and I'm going to do a shopping haul video of the things that I've brought. So yeah, she's going to be nosy, see if there's anything for her. Right, first of all, this is for Mia. No, it's not for you. <laughs> she was being cheeky then. <laughs> Now, this is for Poppy and Emily, and it's a Fisher Price rattle and teaser flower. So it's very cute. And as you can see, it's got the green ribbon. Obviously, I don't want to take it out of the packaging because it's going to be a little Christmas gift, like a stocking filler for them. And it comes down to this little teddy. It's got a pink little dress on, and she's hanging on over a branch. I apologise guys for the light because obviously the weather outside is a bit gloomy today. So yeah, but yeah, Fisher Price Rattle. And then for Oliver, this lovely little digger book. It's very nice and very bright. And obviously babies love that. So yeah. It basically says on the back, diggers, broom, broom. See the little yellow digger on the busy day at the building site. So it's like a little adventure book. So maybe I will do a video at Christmas, me reading it to the triplets. Okay, so that's just like little stocking fillers I've got so far. Uh, now on to other things. Um, basically, I don't know if you guys feel the same, but obviously when you take the babies out and you change them, you don't always want to... Um, you know, put a changing mat down on a surface. You're obviously not sure about how clean it is or a blanket. So I found these um, basically three disposable changing mats, and they're really cute, guys. They're the Tatty Teddy. So and they're really big. I just opened it up to have a look, and yeah, they're really big, guys. And obviously, then it would fold out again. So yeah, absolutely brilliant. Obviously, you could just use this you know for your day you know on a couple of changes you know throughout the day or just as a one-off and then you throw it away it depends but yeah three in a pack so absolutely brilliant so what i might do um uh, is send my friend one if she wants so charlie let me know if you'd fancy one and i will send you off in the post <laughs> because she is a fan of tatty teddy so, yeah, let me know if you want one, honey. Okay, and the next thing I brought, I brought a just these, basically. It says Softies Nappies, so I don't know how good they are. Um, obviously, size um, three, what they call midi. There's ten here, so let's just go ahead and have a look. Let me just see if I can open it with one hand. Bear with me a minute, guys. There is Mia. Have a look at her. She's looking very cheeky. Very adorable. <laughs> right. Let's have a look. Oh, they're really cute. I don't know how good they are, but they're very cute. Look, it's got, obviously it says Softies Nappies. And it's got a lovely little bright butterfly. And it's like a purple one there. And flowers. <laughs> oh, and then there's a rabbit, guys. Like there's bricks. You know, the alphabet on. That's a really nice nappy. <laughs> Again, I don't know how good they would be on the babies. <laughs> um, you know, how often we'd have to change them. But yeah, no, I'm happy I got them something really different. Again, obviously, you know, I'm not going to need all of them. There's ten in here. So, um, again, Charlie, I might send you a couple for the girls. Uh, again, let me know if you fancy a couple. I can send them off with the changing mat. So, yeah, they're really cute too. <laughs> I just put those over there. Uh, 
then I went in another shop and I purchased two MAM style dummies and it says I love mummy in a pink and in a sort of purple it says I love daddy oh, they're very cute obviously from six months but obviously to us it doesn't make a difference you know and the nicest thing I like it's like in a sterilized box so obviously the two dummies I don't know whether you can see that well you know the teeth won't touch so that's really good so obviously you'd sterilize them and then pop them in there and obviously even if one did get dirty and you just popped it in there the other one would never you know it wouldn't meet so really that's quite a good idea I like them I like that so yeah that's another thing and then this um I don't know how you say it maybe just it's obvious mama by um Tommy and basically it is a soft tipped spoon let's have a look yeah trying to do it with one hand <laughs> But obviously there it is, that's what it looks like. There we go. Yeah, so basically there you go. It's obviously like a spoon. And it's got a very chunky handle, so it's obviously great, you know, for weaning. So basically as the weaning stage comes on, you know, it depends at about five or six months, depending on you know how hungry your baby is obviously some people you know are very much old school and obviously they start about four and a half months five months but obviously you know you're told by the midwife to start weaning at you know six months so but yeah this is like a spoon with a really it's like a ball handle if you like but it's obviously easy for gripping and you know so yeah, I really thought that was good. So I purchased that, you know, for when the babies, I'm at that stage with one of them. <laughs> so yeah, that was basically what, you know, I purchased in that sense. And then, um, obviously then I purchased this for Rebecca. She is a lucky girl, which is a Carter's sleep gown it's very very beautiful obviously even the cuffs have like ruffled and around the neck and obviously it's white with pink flowers and obviously goes down to again ruffle at the bottom very very cute and it has matching trousers with the ruffle so yeah they're very cute whether you can see that if I move that and probably put that there it'd be easier yes yeah, so our little trousers again the same design white with the pink flower and ruffles at the bottom so I probably just need to purchase a, a really light like baby pink t-shirt or a white t-shirt that would go with them so yeah so very very cute but yeah we do love the gown I have wanted one obviously for Rebecca and then I saw this and just thought yes I had to get that obviously it needs ironing and that where it's travelled in the bag so it needs ironing so that's that and then I also went into another shop guys and purchased for Oliver again for Christmas which is really good you know I'm not and the, the price guys as well is so cheap obviously it was um, a place called whether you guys know Mac M and Co Mac and Co that's how you say it and obviously yeah there you go M and Co baby purchased this top it was three pound fifty what a bargain and it says mummy's little superhero 
It is so, so sweet. So I purchased that for Oliver. Because obviously, I don't know if you guys know, Oliver used to be mine. And then my mum fell in love with him. So she sort of adopted him from me and then obviously got Poppy. And then obviously the last purchase was Emily. So obviously she has the triplets. So what I would do is I would do another video of the triplets and like a room tour. So you can see, you know, them playing and you can see their clothes and, you know, all their teddies. So yeah, I'll be making a video of the triplets and their room very soon. But yeah, that's what I got, guys, basically. So yeah, I did purchase another t-shirt for Daniel, but it's a Christmas one. So I like to save all the babies' Christmas outfits, and I'll do a Christmas outfit video <laughs> closer to Christmas. So I won't show you what I've got the babies. So I'll leave that for now. I have also got a parcel to open. So there we go. Obviously, don't want to show you too much. This is actually for Daniel, though. So what I will do is, obviously, Daniel is sleeping at the moment. So when he wakes up, I will do a video of Daniel opening his gift from his sisters. And his first mummy, Charlie. So we will do that very soon. I'm going to end with Mia now. And say thank you very much for watching. Say bye. Say bye, Mia. <laughs> Alright guys, thanks a lot. Bye.